Uh, Two hours later. Uh, right, ready? Hi, guys. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> this is good because they'll use this at the start. Yeah. Today, we're going to cook some amazing Indian food with my special guest, author, Natisha Patel. Today, we are making a Malabari prawn. Malabari? Malabari prawn. Awesome. Um, so, it's from the south of India. So it's very fragrant. We're using ingredients such as mustard seeds and some curry leaves, which packs a punch. So first job, chef, if you can dice my onion for me, I am going to start by seasoning my oil. Let's get on. I've gone in with about five tablespoons of oil there. Okay. I'm going to go in with half a tablespoon of mustard seeds. And as you can see, there's little bubbles around them, which means it's working. They're seasoning the oil. So those seeds are popping nicely, as you can see, and they've kind of increased in size as yeah. well. That's because of the, they've taken on a bit of oil. So next, I'm going to go in with some curry leaves. So I'm going to go in with a big handful of dried. And next, I'm going to go in with some red chilli. And as always, when your onion goes in, always season with a bit of salt. That yeah. will help soften as well. So start off with about half a teaspoon. And like we say, chef, you can always add more, but you can't take away. Very true. Mm -hmm. cool. So I'm going to go in with a teaspoon of this paste. It doesn't take long at all, but I just I don't want that raw ginger, raw I garlic. I suppose note. that's the thing as well is when you buy paste in the shop, you really have to cook them out because right. they are processed. So I've cooked out that paste. Yep. So that's all of my wet ingredients cooked out. Next, I am going to go in with my powdered spice. Now, the only powdered spice I am going to use in this dish is turmeric. Right. Um, when you use powdered spices, it tends to dry the pan, yep. and I don't want that this stage. And because it's a very clean fresh aromatic curry. I'm keeping the flavours to a minimum. So like I said, the only powdered spice is turmeric and that's just for the colour. I've put in that turmeric, yep. mixed it in and given it a good minute just to cook out because we didn't want it to be too powdery. Yep. We've cooked out the powder and next I'm going to go in with my coconut milk. So that's about half a litre there, about 400 ml, yep. just under half. I'm going to mix that in. So next, I'm going to go in with the prawns. Um, it has come up to temperature. If you were to put the prawns in into a moderately warm sauce, they just wouldn't cook properly. They'd go a bit rubbery because yep. you'd have to bring the temperature back up. So it's important to have the sauce nice and piping hot. Prawns go in and I'll take a few minutes. Whilst I'm doing that, Chef, if you can do um, some chopped coriander yep. and some lime for me, that would be great. Yeah, absolutely. So I'm going to go in with the prawns. You just want this sort of chiffon now, just nice and rough, just to go in yeah. and it super fine. Nothing too fancy. So the colour of the prawns will transform within minutes and they'll go from that grey colour to a beautiful red. What I'm also going to do, Chef, is get you to put in about half of that coriander. Yeah. I want some for garnish, but coriander is detrimental to this. Do you want it in now? Yep. Thank you. I'm going to stir it in. Now, when people add coriander to a dish, they tend to use the leaves more, but there's so much flavour in the stalk, so don't be afraid to use a stalk as well. So that's ready to serve, yeah? That is ready to serve. Awesome. So in my ladle, I just want to get a mix of everything, prawns, chilli, curry leaves. It's not one of those dishes where you leave bits out. You know, you can eat the curry leaves, you can eat the chilli. Go in with a bit of everything. When you serve it up for your guests, make sure they get to taste every element. Mm. And there you have it, my Malabari prawns. Amazing, thank you so much. Yeah. I can't wait to get stuck into this. We're going to put the recipe on the website. You've got to try it. It's super easy. It's super quick. Thanks for watching. Thank you.